Hello everyone, Ron here from RJJ's Reactions, and as you can see, I am back with Ren, and the song is Troubles. I'm a little bit late to this one, uh, but I've, I've learned that I can't compete with the big boys anyway, so uh, I like to allow the algorithm to run a bit for the artist anyway before coming in and doing my reaction, so this has had a little bit of time out there. I am heading into it with a great deal of excitement, but uh, some trepidation as well, because he's talking about troubles, and I know he's had a lot of troubles in his life with uh, uh, health situation, being bitten by a tick and Lyme disease, and misdiagnosis and medication that uh, messed him up for a while, even worse than the disease maybe, <laughs> and uh, all of these things. A lot of people do face these kinds of troubles. So I'm guessing that might be a part of what he's uh, discussing here, but then maybe not. You never know with Ren. Uh, he also has often a lot of lyrics in his music. I'm not sure if I'll be able to pick them all up here. The CC normally doesn't work and uh, or doesn't work well, especially when they if, if, if he raps very quickly or whatnot. I don't know what's in this song, but he often does. So I will go over the lyrics afterwards, as I often do with Ren and many of the other artists as well. Um, before we head into the music, if you don't mind hitting that subscribe button, it helps the channel a lot. Thank you to everyone who has subscribed and liked videos and commented and sent information. It's a great community, so you really do want to join in. If you want to help the channel some more, check in the description. There's a way to donate to the channel. Uh, there's also a way, it's basically the same way, to buy me a coffee and get your request within days rather than months on the regular list. But I am still adding to it so far. I may start calling some of the list a little bit. Um, but uh, also in the description, <laughs> I'm trying to remember everything here, I will put a link to Ren's channel so you can go there and subscribe and like and support Ren. Ren was one of the major reasons I started the channel. Without him, I probably wouldn't have started the channel a little over a year ago, almost a year and a half, I guess now. And so really looking forward. I've done a lot of reactions to Ren. In the description, there will also be a link to my playlist for Ren if you want to watch them all in one place. Uh, some people like to do that. Let's have a listen to Troubles. Sorry, I know I'm stopping right when he's starting. I just saw the snow there. I'm wondering if this is uh, Calgary or whatever. He was in Canada for treatment, uh, and I think he's been back and forth. I can't tell from that, but I just wondered if this was partly or wholly uh, recorded in Canada because of the snow. <laughs> All right. Uh, I hope he's doing much better. Uh, as far as I know, the treatments have been going well and have been working to some extent, but... Uh, yeah, all best wishes to Ren. Let's go. <laughs> I don't reach into the past very much for these shards of shattered glass and harsh paper cuts. Leave me stuck when I reach in. Memories are seeped in. Hydrochloric acid, I go to war and get passive and freeze up. Music held the ice to thaw. Put the chisel in the middle, swing the hammer of Thor. Pull it out of the impossible, this caliber sword. Edging no past full of reasons why my feelings are sore. The first day that I got sick, ejected from the cockpit of living. 19, young teen, waking up big. Posters up, man, hunt, Ren went missing. Hard to have faith when the gods don't listen. The first year, maybe, was the hardest. Waking in the body that was buried like a carcass. Brain in the lion's den, body in the shark pit. Waking up in pain again, aching, broken hearted. Persistent little bugger, I was bouncing from a doctor to a doctor to a doctor. Like a table tennis game that has no end. So be the fate of Ren. Every single question answered with a question on the end. The second year, I came to terms with giving up my dreams. Mine was ever... Don't worry, I'm going to back up a little bit. I'll just say a couple of things, and then we'll probably go to the end. I am catching quite a few lyrics, but he goes quickly. <laughs> and at first listen, I often have difficulty, no matter what the music. That's just me. Uh, so that's why we'll look at the lyrics afterwards. Great, uh, you know, sort of steady rap here. Uh, relatively slow rap, but uh, 
a lot of meaning in the lyrics uh, and and in his face and coming out you want to uh, i want to smile well first of all i smile and laugh at everything including tragedy that's just me i'm a weirdo um i was lying on the road laughing after i was struck down by a car some people thought i had damaged my head but no that's just ron uh anyway but you want to smile because it's so good because he's so good at his craft and on the other hand you want to cry or or, or be sad because of course all of these issues that he went through from a very young age starting 19 i think he said um makes you just feel for him you just feel for anybody who's going through all of these issues and trials and and tribulations and troubles the title of the song uh but the way he presents it is is so good and i like that that backing uh i don't i don't know what they call it sort of the old rap uh, with the uh, the dj you know when they move the record that's what it sounds like anyway all right i, can, I was going to try to make the sound but I, i'll mess it up so i won't try <laughs> all right let's go Maybe was the hardest Waking in the body that was buried like a carcass Brain in the lion's den Body in the sharp pit Waking up in pain again Aching broken hearted Persistent little bugger I was bouncing from a doctor to a doctor to a doctor Like a table tennis game that has no end So be the fate of Ren Every single question answered with a question on the end The second year I came to terms with giving up my dreams Mine was severed from the means that helped me write these rhyme schemes Brain was inflamed, the fatigue was crushing Hard to remain sane with your brain Brain combusting And the third year was murder Living in a purga Tory for the worry Wouldn't live to be 30 Lifestyle hurt me Always in my bed tomb Rearrange the alphabet And all the letters spelled doom Light hurt my eyes Popping pills to survive When you're 23 And mentally You steadily decline 24 I was poor Disability benefits What's the benefit of disability? It's irrelevant 25 and the scars That were etched They crack Elastic bands only stretch so far And then snap Deep in psychosis Hallucinate Nation's troubled vision This is from the underworld But conjuring my superstition 25 living back at home with my mom But not because I'm a bum Alone and physically done So thin, so frail, so weak I'd become And my skin so pale Never kissed by the sun One time I carved a hole in my chest Just to feel I wish that was a metaphor The struggle was real When you're living in the holocaust You buckle and kneel There's relief in the teeth of the kiss of cold steel Facts 26 I'm highly medicated And the pain sophisticated While I'm lying broke and naked on my back Have on my microphone until my coffin started dropping raw thoughts with the grim reaper knocking on the track But then man, lo and behold I heard an angel beckon on this treacherous road Was a stem cell doctor with a generous glow In the cell transplant pulled me out of the cold And my skin got younger and my body got stronger And my stomach felt hunger for a door that was closed And my soul heard music for the first time Beauty was a word I'd use for this gift of gold Oh Lord, I forgive you Lord, I forgive you, Lord, I forgive you, make me whole, this music I give you, pain that I live through, everything I've been through is yours to hold. Backing vocals are amazing too, feel in your heart. Sorry, I'm, I, I'm just going to back up because there's some text here that I want to look at. <laughs> Conditions like Lyme disease, ME, MCAS, POTS, fibromyalgia, etc. all receive criminally low attention and funding relative to many other conditions. Yes, there are many conditions. Um, I do know people with fibromyalgia. I'm not even sure what some of these actually stand for. Lyme disease, of course, I've heard of before, and that's uh, Wren's situation um yeah they they don't get a lot of attention or a lot of funding in some cases they think it's all in your head um i actually have been having issues since 2007 and so far they just continue to tell me that it's stress 
<laughs> and it's like I've been distressed my whole life, so maybe it is. But then again, maybe not. Uh, so anyway, I have to go back soon and try to figure out what's going on because things seem to be worse. But enough about me. It's not really about me. It's about everybody else here, and that's what Ren is, is putting out there. That's not just him either. Uh, so many people uh, suffer from these things, and uh, partly because sometimes um, these diseases are not recognized, uh, especially if it's fairly rare in certain areas. The doctors just are not aware enough about it so they don't pick it up in time other times they think it's psychological and not really physical not really uh so uh it, or and of course the drug companies etc if there's not enough money in it then obviously they don't put a lot into it either so uh, there are lots of reasons that things get missed and uh, misdiagnosed etc <laughs>
etching notepads full of reasons why my feelings are sore. So, so his music helped to save him and, and jotting down lyrics, you know, etching notepads um, and getting his feelings out. And that really helps. Writing helps. Writing helped me when I was younger. Still does. Uh, but I really needed it when I was younger. I didn't think I'd make it to 30. I didn't think I'd make it to 20, actually. <laughs> so I almost didn't. But um, yeah, very, very... Uh, excellent lyrics again of course he he often makes references uh, and he's got some here to thor and excalibur references to other text movies uh, and things the first day that i got sick ejected from cockpit of living 19 young teen waking up bitten uh, so talking there about the the tick you know being bitten by a tick not knowing that at the beginning of course but he was very young when all of this started 19 posters up manhunt wren went missing hard to have faith when the gods don't listen mm -hmm. Um, that's right. Uh, they don't listen because there's no one there to listen, to be honest, but never mind. <laughs> the first year maybe was the hardest, waking in the body that was buried like a carcass, brain in the lion's den, body in a shark pit, waking up in pain again, aching, broken hearted. So, yeah, um, in one of his songs, and I'm trying to, the name's not going to pop into my head fast enough, his slow brain today, but, um, you know, ho wishing he wake up as another person. Um, I think it's the one he did with Ch uh, Chinchilla, and the name is eluding me at the moment, but it'll come two seconds after I stop recording this. Uh, but anyway, uh, yeah, sometimes you, you go to bed, you want to wake up a different person, either because of the physical pain, but also it can be psychological and, and difficulties that you're going through um, that way as well. You want to be stronger, you want to be a different person when you wake up, and then you wake up and you're brokenhearted because you're in pain again one way or the other or both persistent little bugger i was bouncing from a doctor to a doctor to a doctor like a table tennis game that has no end to be the fate of wren every single question answered with a question on the end so not really finding answers just more and more questions and that's the way it seems to be you go to doctors you go to specialists you they run tests they often come back that you're in perfect health everything's good and yet it's not good you feel like crap and you're you're in trouble you're in pain you're suffering you're you, excuse me both mentally and physically possibly um so yeah it does seem like a ping pong uh, game back and forth back and forth back and forth the second year i came to terms with giving up my dreams mind was severed from the means that helped me write these rhyme schemes brain was inflamed the fatigue was crushing hard to remain sane with your brain combusting so yeah you get to a point where you just can't really handle it anymore and you have to pull back and say okay maybe i can't maybe i can't do this anymore maybe i can't do my job maybe i can't write these lyrics maybe i can't sing any longer or travel or you know so yeah you're just focusing on surviving the day so you it's very difficult and the third year was murder, living in a, a purgatory full of worry. Wouldn't live to be 30. Lifestyle hurt me. Yeah, always in my bed, tomb. Rearranged the alphabet and all the letters spelled doom. Yeah, so he, he just got to the point where he didn't think he was even going to make it to, to 30 years old, living in purgatory. Um, third year was murder. Uh, very good play on words, as, as always with Ren. Always in my bed, tomb. So it felt like your bed was really... You're just basically dying. You're just lying in bed waiting to die. Very, very painful. Very, very hard to read through. Light hurt my eyes, popping pills to survive. A lot of medications. When you're 23 and mentally, you, you steadily decline. 24, I was poor, disability benefits. What's the benefit of disability? <laughs> exactly. It's irrelevant. Um, and this reminds me a bit of, of his Money Game 3, where he's going through the ages, 23, 24, 25. You know, he's going through the ages there. From uh, not talking about him, a, a different situation, but, you know, just when he hit that uh, rhyme scheme in the song, it sort of triggered and reminded me of Money Game 3, also an amazing, amazing performance. Elastic bands only stretch so far and then snap, deep in psychosis, hallucinations, troubled vision, visits from the underworld were conjuring my superstition. So, yeah, that's right. You, you can only tolerate so much and then you, you break, basically, <laughs> or the elastic snaps and uh, smacks you in the face. Uh, so he's going dealing with psychosis and hallucinations. Visits for the un from the underworld were conjuring my superstition. 
25, living back at home with my mom, not, but not because I'm a bum alone and physically done. So thin, so frail, so weak I'd become, and my skin so pale, never kissed by the sun. So just <clears throat> not able to cope, not able to be independent really anymore, having to go back. and uh, That's tough. That's really, really hard uh, to cope with. One time I carved a hole, and when he mentions not, but not because I'm a bum, it means he was thinking about it. It means he was, he was at the time at least, um, feeling bad that he had to go back and depend on his mom or, or get the help. Uh, you should never, when you're in such troubles and no, no fault of your own for sure, you shouldn't feel bad about that, but you certainly do. When you're an independent person, uh, you, you, it, it just, it feels like giving up. Uh, one time I carved a hole in my chest just to feel, I wish that was a metaphor. The struggle was real. When you're living in the Holocaust, you buckle and kneel. There's relief in the teeth of the kiss of cold steel. Yeah, and that's true. And that's why people sometimes cut themselves and do other things uh, because they just want to know if they can feel. It reminds me of a Nine Inch Nails song done very well by them and also by Johnny Cash, of course, Hurt. Um, cut yourself just to see if you can feel. Same idea. Uh, they're on the channel too, by the way. And, but anyway, <laughs> fact 26, we're still counting here. I'm highly medicated and the pain sophisticated while I'm laying broken naked on my back. I brought my microphone into my coffin or my bed, started dropping raw thoughts with the Grim Reaper knocking on the track. Very cool way to put it. Then man, lo and behold, I heard an angel beckon on this treacherous road was a stem cell doctor with a generous glow. Yeah, the doctors are the ones that helped you not the angels, not the gods, so they weren't there for you, uh, because they're not there. Uh, but anyway, uh, yeah, so good to recognize, uh, and I did hear about the stem cell being helpful. Uh, and a cell transplant brought me out of the cold, and my skin got younger, and my body got stronger, and my stomach felt hunger for a door that was closed, and my soul heard, <coughs> heard music for the first time. Beauty was a word I'd use for this gift of Speaking of health issues, uh, sorry about that. I was trying to hold off, but yeah, very good. Um, my stomach felt hunger for a door that was closed. So I think he's relating both to maybe he actually started to feel hungry. I know he still has difficulty and he can only eat certain foods, but maybe he didn't even feel hunger before. Now at least there was something there, but also the just the idea of of finding a solution, right? Find, finding a, to, to solve the problem. And my soul heard music for the first time. Beauty was a word I'd use for this gift of gold. Oh, Lord, I forgive you. Lord, I forgive you. Okay, that goes on. Make me whole. This music I give you. Pain that I live through. Everything I've been through is yours to hold. Yeah, both good and bad. Um, trouble so hard. Don't nobody know my troubles but God. Uh, I won't say any more about that. You all know my feelings about that. I gave up the struggle and I gave up this trouble and I gave up the struggle and I gave up this trouble. Okay. And uh, I gave up and I gave up, gave up this. Oh Lordy, my, oh Lordy, my trouble's so hard. Yeah. Okay. So I gave up the struggle and I gave up this trouble, but he didn't really give up the struggle, right? He's a persistent guy and he, he's still trying to find solutions and I think he is getting there. And, and then at some point you can sort of, as I say, you may find solutions, you might not, or you might find partial solutions, literal solutions, but then for the rest, you find ways of coping uh, sometimes too. It's not perfect, but at least better than, better than nothing. Sometimes you just have to accept that certain things won't be the same and you, and that's okay if you can find a way through it. Uh, very, very good. I've talked too much, but such excellent lyrics, lots to go through. Lots more could be said, but I won't ramble on. Probably some of you have already left thinking I've rambled too far, but that's okay. Uh, <laughs> If you haven't, please give a like to the video, uh, subscribe to my channel, go to Ren's channel. There's a link in the description. Subscribe and like and comment there. Uh, don't forget, you can get your requests a lot quicker if you want. Check in the description, buy me a coffee, we'll do that. Uh, but you have to let me know, of course, who you are and what you want. <laughs> but if you do that, that, that works well. In the meantime, keep listening, keep having fun. If you're having troubles medically or otherwise, try to get some help if you can and uh, write, sing, create. Uh, there's lots of creative things people can do. Everyone has certain talents and it doesn't really matter whether they are, you, you, you don't have to become 
famous or popular or or sell products as long as you're doing something that's making you feel better i think that that goes a long long way writing was what helped me you find links to my books down below as well most of those short stories were written a long long time ago when i was going through a great deal of troubles myself um more psychologically at that point <laughs> and now it's uh, turned to more physical but anyway uh yeah as i say keep listening keep having fun it's ron from rjj's reactions bye bye for now